Hi, I'm Herb Perez, and today we're going to work on rear leg distance drills. We're going to do an attacking version as well as a defending version. We're also going to use targets today. So I like to use single targets for speed, and then I use double targets for power. So we're going to use both of these today to give you an idea of how to use them to improve your distance and your attack. So we're going to start first with rear leg round kick. That's your regular distance. Then we're going to add a little bit of a skip in and round kick. And then that's going to be followed with a step round kick. So again, that's the attacking distance. We have our regular distance, which is round kick. We add a little bit of a skip and a chase, followed by a running chase. Good. We can do the same thing on defense. So we're going to start with round kick. That's going to be followed with slide back and round kick. And then finally, we're going to combine our step and our slide. That's your third distance. So just like our front leg drill, if you've watched our other drill, this is our rear leg drill with three different distances. Let's put them together one more time. So we have round kick, slide, step, round kick, slide, step and slide. Excellent job, good. So Mark did a great job of controlling his distance, recovering, being ready. For your advanced students, what you're gonna to wanna to do is put those together in groups of six, Switch your feet, do them, and probably for a good minute or so, and then switch your partners.